Well, the poison ivy really, really messed me up, man. My whole side of my face is completely swollen. My eyes actually droop a little bit. I don't know if you can see it or not. And uh, I got these bumps all over my forehead. These little bumps and stuff. And, like, my whole thing is like I got a goiter or something over here, you know. It's <laughs> and really, man, it's just kind of messing me up, man. It's on my hands, all the way up to here. It's on my pecker. <laughs> it's on the bottom side of my little penis, and it's on the. Now that went to the to the to the testicles, so they kind of like got a moist kind of thing in there. You know, it's like you know behind my ears, really, really. My my ear is like really bad behind my ear. It's here now. It's like really messed me up, man. I never ever had a reaction to poison ivy yet in my whole life ever. This is like day three right now of the affliction. It looks like somebody punched me in the face over here. And my ear is like, you know, twice the size of a normal ear, you know, like cauliflower ear or whatever. You see that, oh, man? Jesus. Kinds of stuff, redness. I'd show you my pecker, but I don't want to get kicked off of YouTube, so. Alright, it's day four. It's getting a lot, lot worse. I don't know if you can see it or not. My whole side of my face is completely swollen. And now it's all around my eye. And it's like really weird. Like it's puffy all through here, you know. And it wasn't like that yesterday. And now I'm starting to wonder, is this maybe the old dreaded um, two problems at once thing, you know? Because uh, I definitely had the poison ivy exposure, yes, but maybe something else is going on here with my side of my face here. The whole side of my face is like swelling out here. And, you know, what's been happening to me over the past, um, you know, past year or so, my legs are getting swollen ridiculously. And I don't know if you can see it or not, you can probably see it now. You see this here? How swell these guys are swollen all the way up to here right now. Like big time, man. I don't know if you can see it or not. And um, I've been scratching here a little bit, but the swelling here, I don't know if you can see it here, right? <laughs> Look at the ankle. Sorry. See that ankle? How bad that is? Like around here. So this has been here for like, it won't go away at all anymore. This puffing here. And so now I'm starting to think maybe that's what's going on in my face. And maybe it's the old dreaded, um, <laughs> the old programming nightmare of having two problems happen at the same time. Two independent things happen at the same time. Maybe that's what's going on here. I have no energy as well, and this, God, it's just driving me crazy now. My, my ears are about to, like, explode now. It's all this swelling all through here, so... I hope it's a, I hope it's a poison ivy, and nothing else, or it could be actually. You know, there's a one. There's another possibility. Is that maybe? Oh man, it's just so bare. Is that maybe the um, my whole chin the bumps? You wouldn't believe the bumps on, the, on my back of my neck here. And um, I was gonna say it's possible maybe that this poison ivy got into my lymphatic system. Maybe I don't know. Because I was, I was looking at the thing and they said, yeah, if you got any swollen, you have to go to the emergency room right away if you have any swollen lymph nodes. Well, you know, boom. These are like walnuts over here. They've been that way for a long time, but they're even bigger now. So, I don't know. We'll have to watch it one more day. I got to go to the, to the ER or something like that. If I, if I wake up tomorrow, the whole side of my face is swollen like this more. I'm going to go to the ER. There you go. Boys and Ivy. Maybe. It is now day five, and it appears to be at least as bad as yesterday, if not worse. I think it's worse because you got this wrinkling, like a overlapping thing here, which wasn't there yesterday. So, um, I swear my dick is itching so fucking bad, man. But anyway, uh, <clears throat> it's really bad. Everything's really bad. And so I'm gonna have to go to the emergency room today, which you know I you know I dread that. 
But let's see what happens. I'm pretty certain at this point this is beyond a normal, typical case of, um, oh, this, this is really bad here. It's like filled up over here now. It's like a big pouch now. See it? Like a tree gobble thing, you know? What do you call those things on turkey? Turkeys are things that hang down their neck. I got one. <laughs> But I'm going to have to go to the ER now, and I'm pretty sure this is, this is not a typical case of poison ivy at this point. I'm pretty sure my cancer is um, affecting this situation here. Um, I'm pretty sure that maybe some of this chemical got into my lymph system, and, and it's already plugged up, so it's, re it's wreaking havoc. And so now I'm going to have to face my worst fears, which is dealing with my cancer medically and believe me I'm really afraid of that you know it's almost like I don't even know what to even think about this at this point just suddenly popped up this thing here you know but all right we'll see what happens so day five let's see what happens tomorrow day six or I have to go to the ER today